and Jordan from It's Pouring Paint. Today we are doing some votive candles, uh, candle holders, uh, six of them. Jordan is going to do uh, three. Say hi, Jordan. Hi. That's my beautiful daughter. Anyhow, she's chosen some of the colors. Uh, you can see I have an array of colors. These are all mixed with Liquitex. Um, so we are looking forward to using these up. Um, Jordan, what colors have you chosen to do for year three? So I've chosen today to do the dioxazine purple. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bit of a mouthful. I have festive red here and I'm going to be infusing some shimmering silver in there as well. All right. I'm going to start with the purple first. You're going to do a clean pour? I am, yes. Hmm. Those are really neat colors together. Mm -hmm. And the paint seems to be sliding really well down the sides. Yeah. Liquitex is supposed to be the premium of premium. It, I got it at Michael's um, here in Canada with a 55% coupon off. So <laughs> I got saved a tiny bit, but even with that, it's still expensive. But I am, I'm looking forward to seeing some results. Hold on, hold on. All right, go. All right. Yep. <laughs> I'm just going to help it out a little bit. Softening up some of the lines. Yep. Trying to reveal some more of the paint colors as well. That's really cool. It alters the, uh, <laughs> the path of the paint. I like it. I believe I will leave that. Okay. I'm going to have to get that little bubble at that. <laughs> I am going to switch colors up. Okay. I'm going to put the festive red and the dioxazine purple back. Okay. I'm going to keep the silver, and I'm now just getting regular white. Acrylic. Acrylic white. Yeah. And just at your dollar store, $1.25. dollar twenty-five. be taking uh, deep turquoise acrylic as well. Okay. Oh, I love those colors. I will be doing a clean pour for this as well. Yeah, we prefer clean pours. I think it's the bottle. It makes clean pours easier to do. <laughs> but the caps sometimes can be a pain. Yeah. But they do. They work. I just like watching it just slide off the edge there. Oh, that's a good shot. The shimmers in the, I can see it in the silver. Oh. And a bit of white in there and as well. And look at that. I believe that's all I'll be needing for this unless... That is pretty cool. Oh, I can see some of the blue popping up from the top. Yep, you'll see much more of it once I start doing the, my rounds here. Wow. See how that Oops. You got a couple over here. 
Okay, good job. Now it'll just keep dripping down. How do you like it? Yep, I like the coloring. Yeah, that really looks nice. If you tell there's some cells coming up over here as well. Yeah. Color popping through. I'm sorry, my phone. <laughs> it's just a Samsung S9. For some reason, it works wonderful for some people. For me, it just seems to, you know, like to give me trouble because I'm a novice. <laughs> Your next colors, Jay? So I'm going to do, this is um, an acrylic black that's metallic as well. Nope, the black actually, sorry. That black is um, Artist Loft. Um, I got it in a big jug and it is non-metallic, sorry. Oh. I will be doing the ice blue. It is metallic. Yes, love the ice blue. And I'll do some festive red again. Okay, all right. There. We need music in the background. <laughs> Should bring a little thing. We're just getting set up down here. I mean, we've done quite a few pours of our own, but um, getting there, <laughs> setting it up a little better, looking like a little small artsy fartsy place. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. That black, that's the first time I've seen it. Wow, that coverage, how it's just going down, that's lovely. That's Artist Loft. Oh, wow, sorry. The blue is just one oh, of our favorites. I just, I don't know if you can imagine. Too cool. And the festive red. This is Deco Arts. You know, these are the ones that you just get at the dollar store. Probably why the artist loft was so lovely. <laughs> you have to go to Michael's for that. Oh, the coverage is wonderful over here. Yep, you're, you're on this side as yep. well. All right. I'm going to go ahead and go to the top now. Oh. Again, sorry guys. Wow, that's pretty cool. Oh, there's some of the blue there. There's peeking out over here too. But it'll keep dropping with gravity and I'm seeing other blues show up. As you can see, there's some blue. Oh. Uh, ah. Just modifying slightly. That's a great thing is you can do whatever you want with these. I'm going to go ahead and pour a little bit more black on the top. Okay. You can fine tune it and deal, you know. But, as I've said in many of my videos, you have to be fairly quick with it because acrylic does dry quickly. At least the dollar store ones too. Which work perfectly fine with me. I mean, they're all so beautiful. That is beautiful. I love it. Oh, wow, Jay. I can see some cells over here. Leave it at that. Mm hmm. Looks great. Thank you. All right. Let's see the blue coming in. Oh, here. Oh, look at it on this side. That really looks neat. <laughs> wow. Great job. Great Thank job. You. everyone it's now my turn it's Cynthia from uh, it's pouring paint so I'm gonna go ahead and do my three you just watched Jordan do her three um, I'm going to do some blues and a little bit of white kind of like what Jordan did there Aww. <laughs> blurp now this is the acrylic paint this is the cheapest of all of them 
and um, I don't know. I don't mind it. I mean, it is mixed with Liquitex, so how bad can it actually be, right? I'm just going to go ahead and see if I can't do a full coverage with that. Looks like I have a good chance of that. Yep. Okay, so it pretty much went. Now, I, for me, I just... a nice pink color as well yeah I do love the teal I am gonna do a small amount of navigating this paint Oop. I went and touched it it happens <laughs> I don't want to soften my lines too, too much. Maybe I'll have to do a little bit more. All right. Well, let's see. I'm just going to oh. blur the lines just a little. What happened? How do I camera? What's that? You had it on camera? No, I was asking. Watch yourself in. Oh! <laughs> I did a boo-boo. No. I touched it. Do you want me, do you want to see if you can maybe blow some over on it? If you could. <laughs> that works, thank you. All right. See, I like the way yours works because it, it does more for the top part here. Mine seem to be doing quite the straight lines. And I have to renavigate so it looks more marbly than it does straight lines. Well, I think I'm going to let that one go. I'm not sure about it. I don't think that the, all the, I just don't know if the color combination was what I was looking for. However, I do love doing the blues. <laughs> And now I am going to do, I'm going to do a gold and a bronze with a bit of black. Let's see how this one goes. This way we have used every single color. <laughs> so, here goes the gold. And this is deco art. I don't mind them. I don't mind them at all. I love their metallics. You will notice because I have all of their metallics. Now what I love about Liquitex is that it, it um, dries to a shine as opposed to Zinsser which I was using before but is so much less expensive uh, does it to a matte. However, 
I am finding that you can go ahead and um, seal them, which you should do anyways. And when you seal them, um, it brings it back to a gloss. You seal it with high gloss or something like that. All right, let's do this. I am not sure that's going to do full coverage because I have some issues over here. <laughs> I have less of issues. I'm just going to move over. So, oh, some over here. from oh dear um <laughs> just leave it for now <laughs> all right so I think I got full coverage on that and I'm going to leave it I don't know if you can see the top bottom actually of this sometimes the bottoms which you don't actually <gasps> I'm sorry guys my dog just wants to fall, <laughs> and it's just, of course she has to come at this very moment. I'm just gonna. One <laughs> well, there you have it. I have a beautiful pot cake puppy that um, can be annoying, but she's the sweetest thing ever. She just wants to play. That's all. All right, so that's dripping nicely. All right, the next one, uh, I think I'm going to do silver black and teal. No, I'm putting back the silver. I'm going to do the rich espresso. I love this color too. It's just beautiful. All the metallics are beautiful. Hello, All right, now this is the acrylic. As you see, it is a, it, you can actually see that it's a better quality paint, but it doesn't mean that the other paints don't do what they need to do, because they do. <laughs> if I was selling this, you know, maybe you'd want to invest into something a little like these types of paints because you want to be able to give your customers um, great great looking stuff but as far as I'm concerned unless you have a Michaels 55% off coupon you can get in there and then you, then it's cheaper than the dollar store stuff But you can only use them once per day, and it just so happens that I don't live uh, anywhere near a Michaels. So I don't. I do have new paint coming tomorrow, though. I did order some online. I found this amazing deal. Let me tell you what happened. So I went on to a paint place, and. Um, I just started looking at their different Americana um, paints, not like these, but like actual Americana paints in bigger uh, quantities. Oh, love it. And um, they made a mistake on a couple of their larger sized, um, their larger sized uh, bottles because it didn't, um, there was a bottle that was like smaller, the smallest bottle and the largest bottle were the same price. Now, <laughs> that means to me, and I looked at, there's only two errors in the whole thing. I found both of them because I went through it all. Um, but yeah, they had it on. So I got it for super, super cheap and it's beautiful paint.
Wow. The shimmer. The shimmer, the shine. See, I want to get these straight lines out of there. That's why it's okay to, to do your own maneuvering. And I swear I think that that's all I'm going to have to do. These things are really easy to make and they're inexpensive. These particular um, votive holders are from the, um, the Christmas candles I get and then I just freeze the, the remainder and uh, break it out and clean them up and voila, for free, except for the paint. And it's beautiful and wonderful. I think they're all amazing. So the next time I see you, they will be dry. Thanks for joining us. Hope you had fun. Bye. So here we are. We have them all dried up. Looking pretty good. It's one of my faves. I love it. Oh, this is a cool one. Oh, nice. So there they are. Whoops, sorry guys. All dried up.